Welcome back to Educator.com's AP English Language and Composition course. This lesson is on the basic rhetorical modes. Let's get started. Okay, we begin as always with a brief lesson overview. We're going to ask what is a rhetorical mode? And then we're going to look at the four basic rhetorical modes. We'll cover complex ones in a later lesson, but the basics are example or illustration, classification, comparison and contrast, and analogy. So, to begin with, what is a rhetorical mode? Well, a rhetorical mode is a common pattern of argument. It's basically a ready-made pattern of reasoning. Studying rhetorical modes will give you ready-made approaches to writing your essays on the exam. So the more you know about these uh, modes, the quicker you'll be able to outline your essay on the exam and the more time you'll be able to spend writing, which is a good thing. Now, the other reason you need to study rhetorical modes for this course is some of the multiple choice questions on the test will use terminology associated with rhetorical modes. They'll ask you what devices does this person uh, use to advance their point, and if you don't know what half the devices are, you're in trouble. 